Here we are for Star Trek Voyager, and guess what? This is the first one to have some issues. Okay, I've never complained about any of the Alaska tapes or the Washington, Oregon. No, it's the watch. Yeah, one of them came from Washington. Well, all the Voyager ones came from Alaska. This one had a slight problem. When I put it in my VCR, this is non sequitur and twister. I mean, not, not, let me say it again. Non sequitur in the second episode was twisted. Almost said it wrong. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you everything after I'm done with this out, explaining all these. Okay, non sequitur. A temporal anomaly lands Harry Kim back on a time altered Earth where he was never a member of the of the Voyager crew. He must set things right or time pass will remain in ruins. While at the same time he has to try to convince Starfleet that he's not a spy for the Marquis. If that was me, I would have just stayed in that sp space time rather than stay on the ship. But <laughs> I mean, he had the girlfriend and all and they were going to get married. So, all right, next one was Twisted. These are when the episodes start to get good after having an abysmal season one. A uh, spatial distortion results in a, the transformation of the structural layout of Voyager. As the ship is compressed and twisted, the crew must work frantically to stop it before they and the ship are destroyed. I think I can spoil it for everyone. Everyone's seen this. Let's just say that um they just let it come through and eat them alive pretty much because they can't stop it. So if they had known that, they wouldn't have tried so hard. Okay, now let me tell you the problem with this. This is a problem I have not had with any of my Star Trek tapes when it comes to seasons, um, I probably ha I've probably encountered this with movies like First Contact a long time ago or Generations, but this is what happened. I put it in the VCR, and it was going like this. Now that doesn't mean for sure that you can't watch the tape. Some VCRs are not some. Most VCRs. Um, have an automatic tracking feature. Well, obviously that wasn't working. The tape was beyond automatic tracking. It wasn't 100 percent. So I had to go up to it, go up to it, manually push the tracking button, and keep pushing it. And eventually the line stopped doing that, and it strained out. But I didn't have stereo for most of the time I watched the tape. Usually that stereo, that stereo is lit up on the VCR. So it meant the VCR, this VCR tape is um, not at 100 percent anymore. But at least I can still play it. I mean, after how many years? If you look on the back here, these weren't made in 95, obviously. The, the show was made in now. The episodes were made in 95. These were made in 98, I believe, these tapes were made. To, to go back that far, like 26 years, that's going to tell you that these tapes are... They still play, but some of them won't play as good as one another. Then I was having a problem with my CRT television. I had a speaker that was too close to it. I saw this huge green spot of color on the screen. And I thought there was something wrong with the screen. I'm saying, I, I, I took this um, I took this television from my, a grand, from my grandfather's house. And what happened was, is that um, he didn't use it that much. So I thought it was going to be in good shape for me for at least maybe a good four or five years. Come to find it out that there was a speaker interfering with it the whole time. <laughs> Um, okay, so as you can see, every one tape from Alaska has all these things falling apart. Half of the things are missing, but you can't complain. Um, all I like to say is it's fun to watch these shows in a different format besides um, DVD or um, streaming services. It's a shame that not everyone has a Laserdisc player, and I understand the expenses. You could watch this on Laserdisc for sure, because I went up to season 5 on Laserdisc. Um, no season six or seven. That that would have been cool. VHS does the whole thing. According to the fandom database, which I'm not, I don't quite understand it, whatever it is, it tells me that Voyager goes, up, Voyager goes almost to the very final episode, and then all of a sudden it doesn't show you any more tapes. It doesn't make sense to me. Is Endgame, Endgame the final episode on VHS? Because... There's a bunch of um, episodes from season seven, so why not just finish all the way to the final episode? They had to have known the show was going to end. Well, there's no way for me to know if there was an Endgame on VHS. I know there was one on a UK VHS tape, but I don't know about this. Good luck with this, everyone. I hope you follow through with this because it's very important to watch things in different formats. All right, bye bye.